yeah, that's right. Yeah, mole rat in a chair. Yeah, I thought you had little nipples. Nope. Not compared to a mole rat. I don't have eight of them. <laughs> that looks good. I think that's a nice resting spot for this mole rat. Yeah. I'm gonna leave him right there. Just so if anybody comes along, they'll they'll see old man mole rat sitting there <laughs> in his chair. He needs his little friends, I think, too. <laughs> there we go. Very nice. They love each other. They loved each other. Oh, it's slipping. Is it gonna is it gonna last? It's gonna be okay. Let's get out uh, of here. Oh, uh, okay. Uh oh, we got trouble. Oh boy. We ah! got trouble. Whoa, are those fucking mosquitoes? No, they're blood bugs. Blood bugs. Blood bugs. Oh, terrifying! <laughs> Holy, Holy shit! shit. Oh, Don't worry, wow. I dispatched them with ease. I've taken Dude. radiation damage though. I better use Radaway to restore health lost to rads. These are fucking freaky. Oh, they just killed a Brom. Brom. A Brommy. Brom. They killed Brommy. Brom Stroker. Brom and Stroker's Dracula. <laughs> <laughs> I wish that Brahman would have had cryolator uh, ammo. <laughs> Damn it. What the hell's happening? Well, it's a town. I bet there's a lot of crap going down. War going on. I better turn this off. I don't want to get spotted. Oh, there's a firefight going on down here. Uh, oh. Excuse me, sir. I didn't see you there. I got glasses, so I'm a good shot. Fuck yeah. Go, dog. Get him, dog. Hold him. There we go. Oh. Good job, dog. Now do this guy. Dog. Yeah. Get him. Hold him. There we go. Good job, dog. Hey, I mean, here. Bruce, too. On the balcony. What? I've got a group of settlers inside. The raiders are almost through the door. Grab that laser musket and help us. Don't shoot please. that guy. Well, I want to though. He's telling, trying to tell me what to do. <laughs> I don't really respond well to authority. <laughs> I don't want to listen to you, sir. Why not? There's, he seems like a nice guy. Oh, also, okay. he's really hot. Is he? Yeah. Oh, good point. I forgot about that. I love dick. <laughs> Ooh, a short laser musket. Cool. Infusion cells. Wait a minute. Crankity crank. Mm-hmm. Dude, you give dog the goggles. Shit, yeah. Dog. Hey. Whoa, whoa, he's got 200 cryo cells. He has 200 Wait, cryo cells. What the fuck did... Did he took those out of the security box? Yeah, he I mean, couldn't carry the gun, but he took all the cryo cells. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! Okay, I can now use the cryo later. Yeah, yeah life, you can. life is now the best it's ever been. Dog, you are a gift from uh, Asgard. Asgard, yep, <laughs> definitely. You came across the rainbow bridge right to me, my friend. All right, let's give you some glasses just to make sure nobody hits you and your dog eyes. Wear those. Wear those. Put those on. Give me those goggles back, hey. dude. Hey, well, you know, if I hadn't told you to put goggles on the dog, you never would have found your cryo cells. That's a really good point. I'm so glad that you didn't I, understand I, that dogs don't wear glasses. I just thought he would look really fashionable in those goggles, okay? Maybe you just gotta make them doggy goggles. Doggy goggles. Doggles? Doggles, yes. Doggy goggles. Doggy goggles or doggles for Doggle sure. Doggle doggles. Science. I can, oh, I could upgrade my cry later, I bet. Okay, I got one. I got one rank in science. That could go up more. Gun nut. Gun nuts to go with the cocks. I'm gonna have some fun with guns in this. Ooh, what's this? What? what? X cell? What the hell is X cell? Oh. oh my god. What is that? Holy shit. Is that like hardcore drugs? Shit. This must be like the most hardcore drug ever. <laughs> oh yeah, water glue, yes. Any sort of adhesive is going to be very helpful to me, I have a feeling. I got a feeling that adhesive is really helpful in my life when I'm trying to glue things together. It'll make things so much better. Okay, I suppose I should go up here on my quest for cock. There was definitely a grade A cock at the top of that building. Oh yeah, at the top of the Museum of Freedom rests grade A cock. <laughs> well, that's not a terrible shot. Yeah, that was a terrible shot. Do you see any more, boy? Do you see any more? Smell any bad guys? What's that? There's oh, there's one. Whoa. He just lit himself on fire. <laughs> what the hell's going on? Oh, that's good. Okay, I'm gonna I'm coming for you, dickweed. Ah! Oh, creepy guy. Creepy raider woman. That wasn't a guy. Oh, wasn't wasn't? She looked like a man. She really should have done something about that. She looked like a man, but she um her deodorant was strong enough for a man. What? Her deodorant was strong enough for a man, but was made for a woman. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay, good. Ooh, fusion core. 
Wow, I don't know what that's for, but I've got one. <laughs> the squirrel bits! Oh, I hope you took the squirrel bits. That sounds awesome. Of course I did. I love squirrel bits. In fact, I'm kind of hungry right now. Squirrel bits. Oh, don't eat the raw squirrel bits. Yeah, Gross. raw squirrel bits. Mm. Gross. Ouchie. Ouchie, ouchie, ouchie. Hi there. I just wanted to say hi, and I hope you don't try to strike me down. Oh, you missed. Because I'll just become more powerful. You know how that works. Holy shit, he did a ton of damage to me. D uh, dog meat, rip off his junk. Knock him down a peg or two. Oh, that's cool. There you go, dog. Uh, <laughs> you guys shouldn't do that to yourselves. Dummies. Yeah. Oh, you're that's, on fire. You are on fire. I'm fine, just relax. Now, I'm gonna have some fun with these guys. Okay. They're using Molotovs on me. I'm gonna go right back at him. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Look at Dog, he's totally cool with that shit. Oh, bag of cement, nice. Not a bad thing to have. Really heavy thing to have, probably. But... Yeah, I'm strong. Not as strong as your husband, that guy was built. Yeah, I don't want to talk about him, man. I'm looking for fresh love right now. Okay. I'm looking for fresh cum. Dude, that, okay, that's gross. You ever had a cum shot? <laughs> man, I don't know who you are, but your time is impeccable. Thanks. Preston Garvey, Commonwealth Minute Man. Minutemen? What the hell's that? Protect the people at a minute's notice. That was the idea. Oh, that's smart. So I joined that's up. really clever. To make oh god, a difference. there's a bobblehead right there. And I did. <gasps> Baby the bobbity bobblehead! Um, I kinda need to stop talking to you. But don't you want his cock? Oh, right, right, right. Okay, so I gotta try to charm him and make him seem like I'm somebody worth giving it to. Yeah. The world's changed, man, and like, sexual mores have gone away, and so everything's cool if people just have sex right away. You alright? Listen, we need your help. And then maybe we can help you, huh? What brought you out here? The never-ending quest for throbbing penis? Uh, and my son. Sean Nipple. <laughs> That's messed up. I'm sorry. I know how this world can be. It's okay, I've gotten I'm over it. Ago, it only took me like five us. minutes. <laughs> First it was the ghouls in Lexington, and now this mess. You're really hitting me hard with this talk, this dramatic talk about people dying. Oh, it's a cruel world. You think uh, I don't know that? Yeah, the oh, things I've seen. Uh oh, I made him angry. There's a crashed vertebrate up on the roof. Uh huh. Old school. Pre war. Cool. Looks like one of its passengers left behind a seriously sweet goodie. Okay. We're talking a full suit of cherry T45 power armor. Mm. Military issue. Yes. I like it. <laughs> yeah, I thought you might. This is ridiculous. Something. Shut up. Something. Shut up. Somebody I found a bobblehead. Something. Shut up. Bingo. Perception yes. bobblehead. Now look who dog meat brought to us. Dog meat? Oh, your name's Dog Meat. How did that lady know that? Can you see things that other people can't? Like how to make a really good pizza? You're not what I expected dog meat would find in that little neighborhood. What? But oh, so much better. Better. He's a dumb mutt. Is that so? Yep. Well, you still alive, ain't ya? He did get me like the coolest gun ever. It's dog. true. I'll take this coffee pot, and I'd like to take your gun, but I suppose you'll get angry. I'll take this clipboard. You guys, how do I get to the roof? Oh, yeah. Oh, what'd you find, dog meat? Huh? Show, show me. What? What? Whoa, whoa. He found the corner of the building. <laughs> Good job, dog meat. Dog meat is mentally damaged. <laughs> Personal log. United States Army Staff Sergeant Michael Daly. Uh -huh. A vertebrate crashed into the roof of this museum. Mm -hmm. The cause, EMP following nuclear detonation. Okay, I'm kind of busy Several right now, man. Effect. I kind of want you to shut up. The co-pilot <laughs> was killed on impact. Pilot died of his injuries a day later. Fascinating. Day after that, why did you activate this tape? Power armor reduces incoming damage, prevents all damage from falling. Oh yeah. Give me the gun. Let's do this. Hi there. Hey you, over the way. Bye-bye. Mm, <laughs> Why don't you get down here? Show me that fancy I don't think I need to come down there. Honestly, I think I'm just fine where I am. You should probably stay down there though. Yeah, you just stay down there, though, guys. It's gonna be really fun for you, trust me. Uh, oh, it's Gristle. Gristle? It's gristle. I don't, he, who was Gristle, you mean? He's about to be Gristle. He is, he is now, he is now man. literally Gristle. <laughs> you jump to that other roof. Oh, if I could, I could get, I bet that guy has a sniper rifle. Yeah. I wonder if there's a way to get up there. Can, can you run and jump? Eh, I don't think so, but I'll try it. Power armor. Oh! And, ah! Oh. Hello, everybody. That was really cool, though. 
Okay, let's try this out. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh, yes. Uh-oh. What was that? Oh, I see a hand. Oh, oh I see something that could be bad. Oh, it's Godzilla. Grab that stuff quick. Okay, I'm not really sure. Wait, let's let him kill all the raiders for me first. Okay. Before I even start messing with them. Hey, Wait, where are you going to use your cryolator? You should totally of use that. Of course I'm going to use the cryolator. I just want to soften him up a little bit with this. Okay. Oh, he's dodgy. He's very dodgy. Okay, that's not really doing enough damage. No. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Uh, cryolator. Okay, you're a little too close for comfort, my friend. How about you die? Oh, that's, this is supposed to be a good gun. Oh, oh, what's happening? <laughs> uh, the cryolator's not oh, freezing him. Freeze him. Do it. Shoot it more. I'm trying. Oh, it's not doing dick. Okay, I'm not able to freeze him as much as I'd like Ow. to. Okay, I'm not gonna waste no more cry later on this guy. All right, minigun. Time for you to die, buddy. Okay, do you agree with me? Oh, yeah. Yeah, okay. <sighs> it was fun while it lasted, but I'll take those just in case. Oh my goodness, you better make a sandwich out of that. <sighs> I'm gonna eat me some delicious death claw salad. Did you just see me kill a death claw? You really coming you at me? You really think I'm just gonna let you live? You guys really stepping at me? Come on. There we go. Is that all of them finally? Excellent. I'll be right up, Preston. I'm ready for the dick. <laughs> that was a pretty amazing display. Damn Thanks. Right. I'm just glad you were on our side. Oh, yeah. That remains to be seen. Depends on if you're gonna give me what I want. What are you guys gonna do now? You wanna, like, go hang out somewhere? There's, like, a, um, there's a whorehouse down the street. For the longest time, Mama Murphy's had a vision of a place called you can Sanctuary. Kill some mole rats and set them up some in funny positions. Yeah, I do this thing where I like, Why don't you I make chairs these? and then I set mole rats really in them like they're help. still alive. <laughs> it's like a, it's like those Ann Getty's baby pictures. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> That's what I do with mole rats. But it's really grosser fun. and wrinkly. Yeah, they're they're a lot grosser and more wrinkly. It's kind of ironic. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They're like old babies. Where's my son? Oh, I wish I knew, kid. I really do. But it's not like I can see your son. She's I so full of crap. You're useless. <laughs> Look, kid, I'm tired now. Maybe you'll bring me some chems later. Mama Murphy, we talked about this. Oh, no, I'm going to bring her some chems. If that makes her not useless, I'd be happy to bring her some chems. Oh, yeah, she's going to get higher than she's ever been. Higher than giraffe pussy, in fact. Yep, precisely. That was exactly what I was thinking. <laughs> Have you ever been higher than giraffe Thank pussy, Preston Garvey? <laughs> All right. Well, so I guess you've joined the cast of this uh, post-apocalyptic survivor show. I have. Humongous Nips and the Funky Bunch. Humongous Nips and the Follow Apocalypse bunch. Boys. <laughs> Apocalypse Boys? Yes. <laughs> Just follow me. Just follow Humongous Nipple. You can call me Mrs. Nipple. <laughs> you guys are my Apocalypse Boys. And Mama Murphy. <laughs> The Apocalypse Boys and Mama Murphy playing at Fall Lollapalooza. Playing at Fall Lollapalooza <laughs> this week. Hey everybody, we hope you're enjoying our new Fallout 4 Pimps series. Uh, we just wanted to let you know we're not doing sponsorships really anymore on our channel. You may have noticed that we don't really do those very much. That's because we moved everything over to Patreon. Um, where you can go and pledge like a dollar a month, five bucks a month, whatever amount that you're interested in pledging. That's how we're doing it now, and there's rewards over there that you can get. Yeah, it's really cool when you guys are able to give us donations like that. It helps us keep doing these kinds of videos. It keeps uh, the tacos flowing for Emery. And the pasta. And the pasta. Um, I want my pasta well to dry up. Keeps the booze flowing for me. And these are all essential ingredients to our comedy. Pay our rent, buy new equipment. These are all things that are unfortunate necessities to uh, doing this. And so we appreciate anything that you can give us. I really wish we didn't have to do uh, donations like this, but unfortunately it's just an economic reality of the job that we have. It's just kind of a, you know, YouTube pays a little bit of money, but it's not, you know, it, it's obviously not enough for us to live on, and so uh, that's why we rely on you. So, patreon.com slash Game Society Pimps, and we are glad you're watching, and thank you. <laughs>